Hi, it's the Rossum Vegan Gal here, and today I'm doing a video. It's going to be the first video, the introduction video, uh, for a company. It's called, they're called Aura Wellness, and I'll also have a link below to their website. They have so much amazing information, articles, videos. Um, Aura is about oral wellness, so that's talking about your teeth, um, which actually affects your whole body, and there's a whole, so much information on there. Uh, you could spend, I don't know how long probably months and months going through everything. Um, but I first want to uh, say thank you to um, to Chris, who's been um, a great customer service representative who I've been in touch with for a while now, back and forth with emails, and of course to the people who started the company who I haven't been in touch with, but anyway, thanks to Will and Susan. They call themselves the Chief Smile Officers. And um, they are based in um, actually Hawaii, and it says here it's packed with aloha. That's their, their little logo there. Or a wellness so they were kind enough to um, give me their uh, it's it's what they call their healthy teeth and gum starter kit but I got a few extras uh, as part of it as well so um, I think it's a little more than the actual kit that you can buy online and I first was found finding out about them because I was looking for information on what to do if you get x-rays for helping to counteract or counter effect the um, the effects of it and they had some good information on there and it and it led me to discover more about what they're doing and I just want to say I don't necessarily follow everything that they propose to do like the different foods that they eat I'm vegan they're not so there's certain things that I will not consume that they will but there's also ways I try to work with everything to um, to do some better things for my teeth, especially K2. If you've never heard of vitamin K2, that's a whole other story, but you could look on their website. They have so much, like I say, great information, great customer service. If you have questions, they have so much uh, good uh, people out there that are, are there to help you on your journey. Um, so I wanted to, so in this first video, I'm just going to talk to you just in general about the products. So you can go into really lots of detail on the website more what I'm trying to do is to just give you a feel for what they are and then I'm going to take at least a few weeks or more maybe up to four weeks uh, to go through try all the products and then I'll do probably some follow-up short videos this will maybe be a little longer just to talk about the products just my experience with each one so maybe I'll do some a separate video for each one talking to you about them and then compare them to some of the products I have been using currently see where they uh, or work better for me or where I think that maybe there could be improvements either way so that I think will be interesting to show that um, difference you know in some of the products I'm using now as opposed to the products I will be using um, from this company so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you all the different products that I have um, that I will be doing reviews on so first off is their actual toothbrush and they call this brush ego and there's actually a few different sizes, and I learned about this more because there's something called the bath technique. These are the bath toothbrushes, how you brush, and also the amount of bristles. So it's very interesting. And these come in a really nice um, box. It's just a paper, you know, they're trying to do everything a little more eco-friendly. Um, so this is their sustainable bath toothbrush, and there's two sizes. I have the junior, which is a smaller one, to get more into the small areas. I have a small mouth, so I get into the back areas. So these are the two, just to show you that. What they look like and then I'll show you what the actual toothbrush looks like so it's a sustainable it's biodegradable bamboo um, it's also let's see what else uh, they talk about that their ends our ancestors used to brush teeth with wooden toothbrushes very interesting so they created this to help take one step along to healthier mouths and plants for future generations and so what's the brush design unique it's clinically proven to reduce the risk of gum disease and the bristle tufts are more spaced out to better stimulate gum tissue. And it's a shorter handle encouraging a soft hand while brushing. And each bristle tip is polished round to gently massage the gum. So I'm going to show you this first one, which is the, I think the regular size one. Um, and they have different ones with three rows of uh, bristles and ones with four. I forget which ones I asked for. But it comes in this nice package. And I don't know if this plastic is also uh, like compostable or what. And it's a sealed little bag it's in. Oh, because I haven't opened it yet. <laughs> so, um, so it, it says some other things here. Before seabirds died of starvation with bellies full of plastic bits, unfortunately, 
and before they were ever islands of floating plastic in the ocean, before plastic toothbrushes washed up, that's what they were saying about the ancestors using wooden toothbrushes. So that's why they're trying to make a, a, something better for the world, So, which is wonderful. Um, so let me open this one up first, because I didn't realize it's in a little, a little bag again. I'm not sure if this is compostable or not. I'll have to find out, because it doesn't say anything. It looks like it might be, because I know a lot about that. Uh, um, because there's a company that called Biobags. So I don't know if they're familiar with them, and I might want to introduce them to that company as far as putting their products in some kind of a little compostable thing. It's not made of actually a plastic even. Okay, so let me open this one up. Boy, it's taking a little time to open it. Okay, so then I'll show you what the toothbrush looks like. Oh, yeah, so this is the three, I asked for the three row. So this is a smaller a toothbrush, and it's got, and what this Dr. Bass found out, as I saw that on their website, is that he was having some issues too and he kept pulling out more of the bristles and he found that it was better for him because you can get in, especially you can get into places that you can't normally get and it, it, it there's a lot more room to really brush where the bristles are crowded. It's you know, maybe a little harder and they're, like you said, they're, um, the bristle tips is polished round and there's more space to simulate the gum tissue better. So that was the benefit of that. So this one is the, I believe this is the, this is actually the, the not the junior, I hope this was the junior. This is the regular one, I believe, that came in here, even though it's in a bigger box. Well, we'll see, so I'll put that one back in here for now, because I'm not going to use it yet. I'm just showing it to you. And um, Will actually demonstrates on the website about the technique, the bass tank week, where you're kind of um, put, going across, you know, in a certain manner. And I'll show that when I, and I actually do the review of the toothbrush. So let's see the other one. Because it's supposed to be a junior, and let's see if they're actually, they gave me both the same size. <laughs> I don't know. Because it looks pretty small in this one, but this one's maybe smaller. No, this one's actually smaller. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I thought that one's longer. So this is actually the smaller one. So this is also, I believe, three rows. So this is just, the reason why this is, I got the junior, which is more like, like a baby, <laughs> is because this is better for the teeth in the back, where it's really hard to get to, I find. I have a smaller mouth, so this is a smaller one. So it's, and it's the same setup. It's got the three rows and everything, and it's a wooden, wooden um, uh, bamboo. And then one thing that Will was talking about too, which I found very interesting, was about um, you know rotating your, your your brushes, letting them dry so that they don't get what he calls the thug bugs. Um, and uh, you know, and um, that's the other thing is there's some other technology that may be good too as well. Um, for that it's something called like the silver that they use as another toothbrush and I'll talk about that in the future when I do the actual uh, review of each of the products and I'll talk about the toothbrushes I have been using now um, so that's the toothbrush so it's very nice looking forward to trying those out and trying the technique that that Will discusses in his videos so that is the toothbrushes and then they also sent me just to have is one of their other toothbrushes that is plastic um, and I believe this might be the regular size one, but it is also the three-row um, uh, bristles, which I requested because they do have a four-row. I want some more where you can really get there into and stimulate more of the gum tissue. So that is the toothbrush. Next, we'll talk about um, what they call their healthy mouth blend. This is, um, I guess, instead of this is like your alternative as far as a... Um, toothpaste this is more a uh, what they call a healthy mouth blend um, so it has only it's all 100% organic USDA certified it's vegan and certified gluten-free so it's 1.5 ounces and it comes in this nice the paper cardboard uh, packaging it, it says it's 95% recycle recycled material and then it's really nice so it's just this paper packaging and then inside is the actual um, the mouth blend and it's just and it's a liquid and then they have a set of I guess instructions here which is nice to give you some ideas of I guess how to, different ways to use it um, so I'm not going to go through this right now this I'll discuss more when I do each product separately um, they say you could use it to use it in four different ways uh, for brushing put your few drops on the toothbrush for flossing you actually put them on the floss you could swish it um, in, a, in an ounce of water and swish, so more like a mouthwash, or massage it for different areas, cold sores, gum tissue, etc. So there's different ways um, there. And they say here that 90% of us have some form of mouth disease. 65% of 15-year-olds already have active gum disease. Wow, that's scary. 
One out of every three 65 year old has no natural teeth left in their mouth. Yikes. I don't want to be one of those. So I, I'm very proactive about my teeth. I've always have been. Um, and then it says, what else? Is there anything else to just share with you briefly? Um, so yeah, this was started because uh, Will's wife, Susan, she had some real serious periodontal issues. They started it back in 2009 and they've seen some amazing results she had in her health. And you can check that all out on their website. Uh, it's pretty amazing. Um, let's see, what else can I tell you if there's anything else here? So I'll just tell you a little bit about what's in the product. So it's got a mix of, and this is their original formula. It's got a mix of sweet almond oil, organic cinnamon leaf oil, organic peppermint leaf oil, organic spearmint leaf oil, organic clove butter oil, organic myrrh oil, and organic manuka oil. So those are the ingredients. Um, and it's in a base of the almond oil. And uh, let's see what else to tell you. Um, so yeah, they used two to three drops. So this should last, you know, even though it seems like there's very little in here. And, and I haven't opened it yet, but again, I will do that more in the um, upcoming video where I'll tell you more about uh, my using it. And again, I will also go through some of the products I've been using um, before this. Okay, let's get this all back in here now. <laughs> Now that I took it out, okay, so we'll put that in there for now. Okay, then next I'm going to, uh, let's see, what would be next? Uh, let's do the, um, the dental floss. So they have a dental floss that I've actually heard about, and I don't know if I've ever tried it, but it is a good brand. It's called EcoDent. Um, it's gentle floss. It reduces, it reduces tooth decay. It's vegan wax. Freshens breath. Eliminates pla Helps eliminate plaque. There's no plastic. It's a paper box. I'm not going to open it now. But um, it's got 100 yards, uses essential oils, uses mint, no beeswax and no mineral wax, no animal testing, no animal ingredients, made with 11 essential oils, which is really nice. Uh, things like rose oil, rosemary leaf oil, bergamot uh, fruit oil, etc. So many fennel oil, anise oil, so many different types of um, oils, um, jojoba oil. So really uh, good quality. It's soft, gentle floss, expands for bright added coverage. Um, it uses no parabens, no artificial colors or sweeteners. So it's an environmentally friendly packaging, which is great. Um, no plastic floss dispenser either. I think it dispenses right out of this box, if I remember correctly. Yeah, like they have a little thing around it, so it's right in the box, which is really cool. Um, so yeah, I'll be trying this out too as well. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else to tell you on here? Because it's triple sealed for protection to preserve flavor and freshness. And again, I'll be trying this one out as well. So it says over 700 million plastic floss containers are discarded to landfills every year. So this helps avoid that. That's a good deal there. Next is a really nice product. And I have my own that I'm using now. Not some I own. I didn't make it. But one that's also really good. So this is their tongue cleaner. Um, best way, it says the best way to get fresh breath and a healthy mouth. Um, I like that. They say, may having a clean tongue help you speak words of beauty. That's beautiful. It, we should always speak beautiful words, and they tell you how to use it. Again, I'll go through that in the in the follow-up video. Um, but this is nice. It's all in a, again. They're trying to. Um, they were upgrading their packaging so they can get away from plastic. So this contains zero plastic. So that was the whole idea. So it opens like this. This is really cool. And here is what it looks like. That is the uh, tongue. Oops, I dropped it out of there. That is the tongue cleaner. Um, so yeah, it's, I believe it's stainless steel if I remember correctly. Um, I'll have to check back with that. And then, uh, yeah, I believe that's what it is. I don't know if it says it on there. I have to look that up again or, or question them if that is or not. It doesn't say on the, um, cleaner, so. But, but I like that they're trying to avoid plastic. That's really, except they, I do have one plastic toothbrush they gave me. Then the final product, which again, I don't know if this is part of the kit, but um, it was a product that really intrigued me. And at first I was hesitant because, I mean, it's not vegan. Um, but it's something that people have had some really great success with helping to remineralize. It's a remineralizing tooth whitening powder. So um, because I'm not consuming it, you know, meaning I'm not... It's not going into my body in the sense that I'm not drinking it or, or you know, like doing something like that. It's not. I'm not. It's it's different because I'm only using it on the surface of my teeth. So I was agreeable to actually try it. Um, so this is called Shine. It's a remineralizing tooth whitening powder, natural tooth defense, and it's in mint. 
the flavor added 60 grams, which averages 200 uses. So it says it's not just your teeth, the exact minerals your teeth are made of. Leveraging three separate remineralizing strategies, one called MCHA, which is from New Zealand grass-fed cattle, xylitol, which is non-GMO birch-based, and calcium lactate, which is a non-dairy source. So it says it is certified gluten-free, it is not vegan-friendly, just so you know it is paleo, it is non-GMO, and it is fluoride-free. Um, it's also free of soy, fluoride, SLS, and nothing artificial, just 100% goodness, it says I like that. So they tell you how to do it. You, uh, there's actually a few different ways. I think Will was showing you in some videos how to use it, but um, you could do it. He says, you know, moisten your toothbrush, add shine to bristles using an included spoon. And he actually showed, because I've done that with some um, tooth powder, is, you know, he put it just on his hand, you know, easier than try to put it on the toothbrush, put it on your hand. And then, so again, I'll, I'll talk about that more in the follow-up videos. Um, you brush, you can reapply as shine as needed. You spit and rinse. Um... So I will open that up to show you what it actually looks like. See if there's anything else to tell you here. Just got to get off this little seal on here. I guess I can just do it like that since it's easier. And I'll show you what it looks like. I believe it's in a glass jar if I remember correctly. Yeah, so this is Shine. This is what it looks like, and let's see if there's anything else on here to show, tell you. It says here, helps prevent tooth decay, supports remineralization, gently polish and whiten your teeth. So I'm looking really forward to this one. It says keep the powder moisture free, or failure to do so will cause clumping, and it's supposed to have a spoon, unless it's inside here. It doesn't, I don't see it. It says, using the included spoon. Hmm, I wonder if they forgot to send me the spoon. That's okay, I have little spoons just in case. Unless it might be in the actual jar, which I'm not opening right now. Um, it's also free of corn, I didn't mention that. Fluoride, fillers, preservatives. Um, it also has sodium bicarbonate, white kaolin clay, magnesium carbonate, peppermint, spearmint, Himalayan salt, and menthol. So just so you know some of the other ingredients. So yeah, I don't know if the spoon was forgotten or what, but it's okay, I have some little wooden spoons, so that's okay. Um, and it doesn't say how much you use. I guess you just use a little, a small amount, I would gather. But I'll follow up with some of these questions with them as well, just to see um, if they have some answers for me. So, that's all the products from uh, this company that I'm going to be reviewing. And again, I will take some time to do it. So this is just to introduce you, so you could actually go on their website and check out. I mean, you, you can, like I say, there's so much there, and so much really great information. They've really done a lot. Of, of, of a service to the public uh, with all the information that they're sharing uh, for us to read that's for free and to really learn a tremendous amount. They've really done a great job. So again, I'll just go through the products just to show you what I'm gonna be reviewing. For first, I have the Brush Eco. I have the regular size and the junior. Um, and that's uh, the three bristles, the ones with the three rows of bristles. And then they also, like I said, gave me the plastic one. Um, I might just save that for like traveling. <laughs> Uh, and then we also next have the um, Healthy Mouth Blend. That's to use as like a toothpaste. And then the um, Eco Dent uh, Premium Dental Floss and the Mint. And then the uh, Tongue Cleaner. And finally, Shine, the Remineralizing Tooth Whitening Powder. And I hope you check out this website and learn so much that will help you on your journey to optimum health and wellness. And I thank you for watching. It's the Rossum Vegan Gal.